The new family leave proposal on Capitol Hill is raising awareness about the challenges facing new parents. The Cradle Act, is what it's called, was introduced yesterday by Republican Senators jo Joni Ernst and Mike Lee. It's being praised by Ivanka Trump. The legislation joins bills by Republicans and Democrats to address a problem that lawmakers agree urgently needs a solution. Nancy Cordes sat down with Ernst and Lee. That sounds like a law firm. She joins us now from Capitol Hill. Nancy, good morning with Ernst and Lee. Good morning. You know, it's hard to believe, but it's been more than 25 years, Gail, since Congress passed its last piece of family leave legislation. Meantime, every other industrialized nation provides a set amount of paid time off after the birth of a child. But now, Ernst and Lee and many others think the stars might be aligning here on Capitol Hill. Thanks, everybody, very much. Um, Tuesday's announcement by Senators Ernst and Lee added two more Republican voices to a debate uh, long dominated by the left. Families, of course, are the bedrock of our society. It's giving both sides hope Welcome that this year will be different. This issue is now part and is the center of public discourse in this country, which is great. It's an issue that's been championed by President Trump. Let's support working families by supporting paid family leave. At the urging of his daughter Ivanka. The world has shifted, and our policies need to reflect that shift. Proponents think her interest could help push a compromise across the finish line, the way her husband's passion for criminal justice reform did last December. Tell me a little bit about how the two of you ended up working together on this. Republicans Ernst and Lee called their proposal the Cradle Act. It would allow new parents to use their own Social Security savings to help finance time off. So you can take one two or three months of parental leave uh, and as a consequence of that choose to delay your retirement date by two, four or six months. Is this something that would apply to caring for a sick relative, a parent as well? Right now it just applies to the adoption of a child or the birth of a child. We are very focused on parental leave. Democrats have a different proposal. Their Family Act would institute a small payroll tax to provide up to 12 weeks to care for any loved one. Democrats say the GOP plan creates a false choice between retirement savings and paid leave. I respectfully but very strongly disagree with that. You say that to anyone who would have the opportunity to use this. That would be news to them. And when you say they're going to add four or six months to their retirement date, that's not insignificant. A lot of folks will focus on, oh, the end of the retirement age, but oftentimes we don't talk about that baby. It is important that we focus on that too and not just think about maybe I'm going to have to work another month or two or three, but focus on the benefits that will come to that child as well. You think this could have a lifelong impact I think on the babies? A, most definitely. Very few people would disagree with that, but the question is, can the two sides find a compromise? I asked the Senate's Majority Leader Mitch McConnell yesterday whether he's committed to holding a vote on paid family leave this year. He said it's too early to say. It just depends on what his colleagues come up with. John? Nancy, thank you.